Scorpio, hi, it's Elle here to do a quick reading for you. This energy will be for the next seven days. Um, I've got some cards pulled here. Let's jump right into it. Scorpio, okay, so somebody is in love with you, you're in love with them. This could be like a twin flame type of situation, or you're feeling that way, or maybe it is, I'm not sure. Um, there's a lot of change happening for you for the next seven days. Now, this could be in regards to either engagement, someone proposed to you, or vice versa, you proposed to someone else, or you're already engaged, but then there's a hesitation here about, for some of you, following through with actually getting married. Um, someone may be confessing to you that they're not ready, or you may be saying this to someone else, or they may be saying that they feel like you aren't ready, or the both of you just aren't ready. Um, they want you, they, they view you as their wife, as their counterpart, but they need to, I don't know what the hold up is. Um, if you're making plans for a wedding, the cards are telling you to wait because somebody is having cold feet for whatever reason. If you are a Scorpio man or woman and you plan on proposing to your, your significant other, it's the same way. Because you, you got the three of swords here twice. You may get your heart broken. Someone may say no or yes with stipulation. Um, or yes with a long engagement. Um, that's what's here in the cards. Um, the relationship is working. Okay? It's working. But um, maybe some people don't want to push it as far um, or, or push it so much as you, as you do, Scorpio, or vice versa. You could not be wanting to um, get uh, go through with the marriage or, or even get engaged. Somebody's holding something back, like they're reserving something for themselves. Um, I can't say that this person hasn't made long-term plans for you, with you, you are in their long-term plans, or vice versa, but the cards are cautioning you to just wait and, and reserve some things, wait for maybe this baby announcement, or engagement, or proposal, give something small, okay, um, because someone feels like they have to think, maybe they feel like they aren't ready, um, they feel like they, there's fear here. They feel like they've already tied to something else or they need to get over some addiction or vice versa. They feel this way about you. Something that they're holding from you, that they're reserving, that they're pushing down, they're suppressing, and they're not dealing with. Could be you, Scorpio, could be the other person. Um, yeah. Uh, so... And they could be holding on to somebody else or, or codependent relationship or something else. Something that you just don't know about, okay? For some of you, this is your adult children. Maybe they are coming to you saying either I'm pregnant or I'm getting married or vice versa or the, or, or both. Um, once again, another energy, the hangman with, in, in the advice is asking you once again to wait. Wait, because you're going to get what you want. You're going to get stability here, but something needs to dissipate, either on your person's side or your side. So just wait and so you won't come out with egg on your face. Just hang on there, okay? Um, the person that you are thinking about, what they want to tell you is that I am happiest with you, okay? That's what they want to tell you. They want to say to you, I give you money. That should be enough, okay? Um, they want to say that, you are a sexy wife or a sexy husband. Um, they want to say to you, will you have my baby? Or someone's asking you this. Or maybe you're asking someone else. I don't know. Um, they want to say to you, um, I'm very insecure. And maybe this is what's holding them back from taking things to the next level with you. They also dream about you. It says, I, I dream about you. I dream about you. Okay. Um, but then you see some truth and clarity maybe surrounding how things are going, how fast things are moving, maybe other relationships, money, inheritance, business, um, 
taxes. You guys need to get to the financial of the situation also. Um, something is being reserved or held back here from you. Um, the, the cards are as also asking you, do you want to, uh, do you think you can share a life with this person? Do you think you can retire and spend the next phase of, of the relationship with this person? Um, Four of Pentacles here is also said, do you even want to share your money with this person? Do you know how much money this person has? It says that whatever you do, be assertive. Or however you come off, be assertive, but not demanding or aggressive. All right? So that is your reading. I hope that it also, here we have adult children, okay? Like I said, one of your children could be coming to you with good news or not so good news or, or, or just more so um, turbulent news. And you just didn't know it was happening like this. Um, you could be falling in love like so deeply, so fast also. Um, you could be seeing someone in a different light here, okay? Um, and maybe that's what is making you want to push things forward so quickly. Um, or someone else's, or maybe your counterparts, their adult children, and that's, they're taking a toll on your relationship somehow. Okay, so I hope that this reading resonated with you, Scorpio. Go over to the website, book your own reading there. Take advantage of the text question. You can text your question to the number below. Pay for your question. Receive the answer to your question all on your mobile device. Take advantage of that. Thank you, Scorpio. Have a really good week.